So this place was built back in the 1420s, so it's as old as the feckin' hills now at this stage, and has changed ownerships a few times over the years up until it was left abandoned in 1909. As always though, there's some sort of tragedy in every large building in Ireland supposedly, and the one here has been compared to the Irish version of Romeo and Juliet. The name of it now, I don't know what you'd call that though. So basically, and as they all go, young lady Aileen who lives in the castle had the hots for some young lad who the dad didn't approve of. I bet you can tell where this is going now already. And basically when the owl had heard the shenanigans that was going on between them, he ambushed, imprisoned and tortured the young man. He held him captive for a few days until one night Aileen's father dragged him to the base of the tree where he slashed him numerous times with the sword in an attempt to kill him. And apparently the big man himself is a fan of Ku Cullen because my Jesus he didn't go down easy. Aileen's owl had thought all the troubles were sorted but little did he know that Aileen watched a brutal murder from the round tower and in her heartbreak she jumped to her death. So like, I don't know what he was expecting. 